Hey, it's Landon Rivers. So you remember in the last level where I showed that it was a lot easier to beat the level on easy than it was on hard because you hit things for harder? Well, in this level, it's the exact opposite. It is much quicker to finish this level on hard than it is on easy for one particular part, and you'll see it at the very end when you fight the boss of the level, Eric. In hard mode, you have no checkpoints and you have no cutscene leading to that checkpoint. But in easy, you have to go to that checkpoint, and then when you go into the room where Eric spawns, the door shuts behind you during the checkpoint cutscene. You can't get around it. And the, the spot to spawn Eric is a little further in, and so you are stuck in the room having to fight Eric in the room and then climb up the ladder, dodge around guys, hit a switch, jump off a balcony and exit the room in the time down hard where you could just spawn him and pull him out of the room and then just kill him outside. So this took... A, an extreme amount of execution and you'll see I pull off a trick that is very hard to do which is killing Eric in only one combo like when you do that that's the golden ticket you you know that you got a golden ticket if you if you're able to pull that off and uh, you'll see how I do it it's it's that's a hard thing to do um, but um, Leading up to this, though, I, I'd say that knowing that I have a good time is me getting about 120 when I step onto the grass right there. And so I know, okay, I'm going to commit with this one. Uh, also, at the same time, I have my, my friends from Russia, Ukraine, and there's also fucking Jared in chat. So here it is. Killed him in one combo, and so at this point I'm freaking out, and I'm able to dodge around the guys pretty easily, hit the switch, jump over the balcony, exit, and at this point he killed he this killed him it. outside at about like this 142, and so I'm freaking it. out right now, and I just knew like I saw that was that was gonna be the one, and I was it was it was about two in the morning, and so I was uh celebrating but not too much <laughs> and so let's take a look at this in slow motion with the start and these the end so here is me starting pressing forward and the start and the watch at the same time and i i always do it at the same time to make sure it's precise here it is at the very end and we are going to do once again the starting and stopping until the screen is fully black and also this time because it's so close i'm going to show a high contrast version so you can see uh, on your monitors that for sure here is me ending at a 147.24 now we're going over to the voids time, and I had to time this one myself because he did not have a timer going on, on his, so we have a visual representation. You can see uh, it was actually really hard for me to time this one, and he got a, he got a, like almost a step in before I started the timer up. So it's it's a little more conservative in the timing for him anyway. Uh, but here we are at the end, again with a high contrast, so we can see for sure when the screen is completely black. And going through, we can see there's still some, you can see at 26 and one. 4730 is the time. Hey, let's look at that last part in slow motion again. So, yeah, we had gone through this 333 times, and it had been about three days of running through this, and all my friends were watching me, and so I was just like, you know what? Let's just have a little bit of fun. 